10.30 on a holiday Monday. Uh, we have some rain coming in tonight, uh, potentially snow in the gorge. We're watching that. You can get updates on the weather site. What I want to use this video for is to track this large area of Arctic air. And for some, the most frigid, cold temperatures that we've seen so far this winter season. This is Saturday our time at 4 p.m. And here's Portland right down here. So, again, here's the cold air up in uh, central Canada. And let me just play this into Sunday morning. As we play it into Sunday afternoon, here's Portland. Here's this cold air now extending and a, a piece of it extending out almost towards Vancouver Island. That's Sunday afternoon. And then if we play it into Monday morning, notice how a piece of this cold Arctic air right here in this brighter color knifes down over the eastern gorge and into central Oregon. That's very, very cold stuff. And that continues to be the case, taking a line east of the Cascades into Tuesday morning of next week with the center of the coldest air, the cold core, if you will, Tuesday of next week, a week out, over Montana and into uh, North Dakota. I want to show you what we're looking at as forecasters because some of the computer models are bringing cold enough air into Portland this upcoming Sunday that morning rain would possibly transition into snow. And then we'd have maybe some snow flurries on Monday, have another shot of potential snow accumulation in the mid part of next week. That would be a week from this Wednesday. So again, it's a ways out. Other forecast models take that cold air and they hold it just far enough off to our east that we never get cold enough for snow and the Willamette Valley would just see rain. But the models right now are basically trying to decide, do we get impacted by that cold air? And if so, next week we would have several snow chances or does it stay off east of the Cascades. So keep updated on that. Thanks for using this weather site as always. Keep updated on the gorge snow Monday overnight into Tuesday and also heavy snow moving into the Cascades.